Hey guys, welcome back to Fallout 76. So I'm over here at my camp, which is miraculously still here. And this time I'm just going to start heading south and start checking out uh, places uh, I haven't been to yet. Anything I come across, any markers I see. I'm going to have to pass up this little shopping center place here. Oh god, frame rate. And yeah, just going to start heading towards Watoga. I'm sure there's lots of stuff in between there. I went and I got my, um, my Gatling gun just because I had some 5mm ammo laying around. And I've got my shotgun and my railway rifle and my ski sword thing. Every time I log in, damn things are here again. Okay. Hey, I'm almost level 58. <laughs> All right. It's going to take me a minute to get uh, into new territory, so I'll meet you over there. Valley Galleria, that's what it's called. I also went, uh, before I started playing, and went down to the ash heap and picked up some fusion cores. Because I was running low. I got lucky and found four in a very small area. Which is not too common. There's a workshop, or a... Yeah, a workshop up here. I'm um, still not much for like taking workshops and holding them, but I'll get them. I'll get the marker. Kind of just going to be heading straight south regardless. So might as well. See another mark just beyond it also. I've had rad worms for a while now. And blight. Disease cures, I'm always... Dabney Homestead, okay. Well, I don't really care about securing that. At the moment, but I do care about exploring the location. What do we got here? Ginseng Road. What do we got? Copper. I'll take some ginseng root. I don't know what it is what it's for, but copper. Looks like all the enemies are dead here. I need to remember to pick up. Oh, oh. right. I've got some plans I need to read since last time. Last episode, we checked out a really cool location. It was a uh, oh, Tangara town. Uh, wasn't a real long episode, but it was an interesting place. Oh, I need to go back to Berkeley Springs sometime. Uh, maybe not right now. But, uh... I'd been there before. I think I probably said this. And I my, my uh, footage got trashed. It's a pretty cool town. We'll go back there. Right now, I feel like going somewhere I haven't been. Okay. Check out the rest of the homestead. I'm not seeing any other marks other than that one right ahead of me there. Let's see what that is. This Dear Tucker. Dear Tucker, in case you come looking for us, we've gone to Harper's Ferry. We thought we could make a go of it, go at it here since the laying was still producing and you know how much your mother is into canning, but it's just not safe anymore. We had a fog of some sort roll in from the north. That's when the vines started showing up and the critters around here started to really change. It wasn't until those vines pushed through into the house that we knew we had to leave. We hope you're safe, son, and if you find this message, message come to Harper's Ferry. Times like these, we need safety in numbers, Dad. I have explored Harper's Ferry already. It was a long episode, uh, a little while back. It's pretty cool it's a city. Thought maybe we could go into the basement, but it looks like it's collapsed. So, okay. Yeah. All right. Let's uh, head out towards this. I really need to get on with some of the main story stuff, but uh, I don't know. I'm just not really that worried about it. Uh, 
I haven't gotten anything from the Overseer in quite a while. And I'm pretty sure I need to be going to the nuke sites to uh, get that stuff. I just, yeah. I see a sentry bot over there. I've been more interested in just, uh, <clears throat> just pushing south, exploring the mire lately. Another location that way. What the hell is this? <coughs> Pardon me. <clears throat> Still a little sick feeling, so... I'll edit out all the coughing I can. shooting like he's shooting over so oh I need a um <laughs> I need a laser rifle I have a bunch of uh I need to save take that and mess with it I have a bunch of uh fusion cells and I had gotten rid of my laser weapon all, all my laser weapons what is wrong with this server these guys are doing some weird shit Take it, he was just sitting there letting me kill him. Oh, 58. Uh, I guess I'll take that. You have a bunch of crap. So, oh, this is a weapon. Oh, I don't have stuff to work on it. What is this? Yeah, level 45, not terrible. Uh, I'll keep it with me for the moment. Yeah, I've got a lot of fusion cells to waste. I just uh, haven't had a laser weapon in a while. I'm having a hard time finding one that's level 50 at least. Go on the cramp. Do need stuff. One thing I've been neglecting to do off camera for a while is uh, go around and do scrap runs on my own. So I'm kind of always low on stuff. Door is locked. So. Really sprint. My stupid shift key is kind of broken on this keyboard. I have a old Logitech keyboard that's nice and quiet that I use when I record, but it's uh, it's old. So shift key is kind of dead. The only other one I have right now is a mechanical keyboard, and those are really nice to type with, but uh, they're really loud to record with. Broadcast station key. Don't suppose that's around, is it? None of those mutants had it. Well, I mean... Pretty sure I looked everywhere, didn't I? Hit bus. Okay, Max. Yeah, these guys don't have it. Is there something up here? Ah, uh, we'll never know. Maybe back in there? No. Hmm. Let me just make sure before I leave. This might be part of a quest. I'm gonna guess that it is. Oh well. At least I have the marker now. Well, let's push on to whatever this house is down here. Something off of that way too. There's a military site off that way. I haven't actually explored a single missile site yet. I keep meaning to and then getting sidetracked, wanting to check out other stuff. One of these episodes. Going towards Watoga. This place looks interesting. I 
Pennsylvania Surgeon General Steakhouse. Sure, but I want to see what this what's this trailer. Ah, crap. What the hell is going on? I oh. They fighting each other. Guess I should pray. Oh, there's this goddamn scorch beast. I do need to kill them for my my enclave stuff, but I'm not. I mean, I'm not really in the mood. I'm probably gonna have to though. It's like impossible to uh. Avoid them once they're there. Who the hell is shooting me, anyways? Is there a person down there? Hold on. Come on, game. No. Just this guy over there. Probably gonna have to sh fight this guy. <sighs> Fortunately. How do I get out of here? Oh, fuck. Level 81 Death Claw. Just what I needed. Where the hell did he come from? He's going over that way. Oh no, he's coming back. Now he's going that way. What the hell is happening? Is it gonna go? Oh, shit. Shit's getting dangerous. Let's go back a little. I hear mutants fighting that thing. Maybe I can kill steal him. Now I've got a death claw to worry about too, though. <clears throat> and I'm actually a little more worried about that than I am the Scorch Beast, to be honest. Alright. <clears throat> Let's get over there. It's landed. It's landed. Ah. Son of a bitch. Now it knows I'm here. Oh, it's level 80. That's nice. a death claw. Shit is going sideways. other shit to worry about at the moment. And there's bugs. The General Steakhouse. Do you shoot please? shit to do. Is it gonna leave? No, didn't think so. That's nice. Yeah, right. <laughs> Never gonna hit that thing from here. Why don't you come back over, bitch? Why don't you land? God 
God damn it. Fuck. Yes, I know, I know. Bad. Oh my frame rate, Jesus Christ. Too much happening. Get the fuck out of here. Oh, uh, let me just take that from you. Oh, there's a guy up there. Cheers there, sheets, bro. Some sort of facility up there. Anyways, this is what I was here to check out. I had no idea that guy was even up there. I was wondering why I was dying so fast. I didn't think the mutants were doing that much of a number on it. God. Five star general. Post apocalyptic call this guy post apocalyptic culinary review by Glenn Ramos. Being one of the few fine dining destinations in Appalachia, General Steakhouse was always a treat to visit. Even after the restaurant was forced to change its menu due to shortage of quality beef, the restaurant's proprietor Milo did an expert job crafting crafting a palette of down home Southern fare. I must admit, though, I ugh, I can't speak today. I must admit, though, I never cared much for the general's clientele. Too many uppity tech types from Robco trying to one up each other on pretentiousness. These days, the steakhouse attracts a more pleasant, less pompous crowd, despite their shriveled appearance and ravenous lush for my flesh. Four stars. Okay, so that's a Robco facility across the way. Sorry, there's a train past my house. Can't do nothing about that. Probably here in that manager's terminal. Um, none alone. Okay, Robco customers. <clears throat> All wait staff should give extra consideration to any customers that come in from the Robco Research Center. They make up more than half our clientele during the week. Manifestos in the basement. Boss, I put all the copies of that nutcase's manifesto in the basement like you asked. You sure we shouldn't go to the police? Safe control. Okay. Manifestos. Well, we'll see about that. Gone scrounging. Scratch up supplies. I'll be back in a couple days. Look, I know you think we should go. That we don't owe these people anything, but the world ended, man. We can't keep taking advantage of each other. Alright? We need each other now. All of us need each other. I mean. God, did you see Marty? It's almost as if his skin melted. How's he still alive? Look, just make what's left stretch until I come back. Do what you do best, man. I improvise, right? Okay. All right. Three sheets. Doing his thing. Way out. Place is pretty impressive, actually. More impressive than I thought it was going to be. Alright, let's go down. Ah. That was it. Boiled water. That was all that was in there. to be picking up some crap as usual as always should go without saying 
Oh, I got some recipes and some plans I need to read here in a minute. What's this? <clears throat> Delbert's Bunless Cram Burger. Bunless? Okay. I don't need fuel. I need some more stuff to... Rewatoga. I need some more stuff to plant at my base. I've only got blackberries. Uh, this looks like... Oh. The Free Watoga People's Party. Ah, commies. Of course. Gamma rounds. I don't see those too often. Don't really care to read their manifesto. Come on, where you at? Come on. Oh shit. Ooh. Some plans. Including some for some power armor stuff. That's pretty cool. I wonder how many, um, oh, I wonder how many more combat commendation things I need for the Enclave. Probably like five or six. Uh, four more. And then we can do more Enclave stuff. I'm sure I'll, uh, come across four more Scorched Beasts to kill sooner or later without even having to look for them. Okay, I don't want the mini nuke though. I don't want the mini nuke, I want a hot plate. Isn't that just about the size of it when it for Fallout 76? <laughs> Scrap more useful than oh hey, there's a bunch of stuff out here. I see three sheets is still chilling. Let's grab some stuff to plant. If I actually get back to, uh, my place before this all goes crap on me. Can actually plant some things other than blackberries. See the gnomes kill the flamingo, huh? Oh, crap. we go. Fusion cells do not want 10 mil. Ah. Hey, another railway rifle. Maybe I'll get a mod from that. We got 308. Absolutely take that. 45. Same. Syringer. No thanks. Uh, I guess I have not gotten all the supplies yet, eh? What's in that that I need? Okay. Let's head to the roof. Let me go up. Up more. This way, I guess. Sleet up. How did three sheets get up there? Ah. Okay. Ooh, a lot of stutter going on here. I don't know if I'm going to go into the Robco uh, thing on this episode. I have a feeling that's going to be one of those places that 
that a friggin' electric chair? Okay. I have a feeling that's gonna be one of those places that's gonna take a long time to get through. Because it's a Robco facility. So maybe we'll leave that alone until, uh... Till later. Buff tents. Just crap. Get some good stuff from here, though. I'm very tempted to go over there. Uh, there's also a farm off of this way I kind of want to check. We'll just remember it's right across the street from the generals. Maybe next episode or something. I have a feeling if I go there now, this is going to go on for like hours. Which I guess is okay, but not right now. Let's go over here. Bought a scorched beast and a steakhouse. Where's that dot? Is that a person? Yeah, we're finally getting out here. Into a different kind of country. As much as I love the other part of the mire, it's cool to see something else now. Where's that dot? Am I going towards someone's camp? Oh no, it's... Gent. Here. Is checking this place out. Hope he doesn't mind some company. Manx Farm. Is that alive? No. Interesting. Enola Walker's story, part one. This is Enola Walker. Don't know if anyone will hear this, but um, life finally took the last thing I had left. <clears throat> Figured I should leave something behind. I lost Joan in 77 and the kids in the drowning, but um, I had my damn dogs. It's bad enough that beast tore up the homestead. Ruined everything. I could have rebuilt, but, um, <clears throat> but it's not worth it without my boys. So, if you find this place, I'm willing it to you. <clears throat> just, just let anyone listen to this tape and they'll know. <clears throat> I took the last of the good cans for the bites, but the rest is yours. The last thing I'm going to do is hunt that ugly beast down and kill it before I go. <clears throat> I hope you have a good life here. <clears throat> but that monster flew off towards the steakhouse, so maybe avoid that area. Unless I turned it into a fucking crater. Oh, well, we uh, dealt with that. Ready? Okay. What is off this way? Yeah, this is the... This region... It's the Cranberry Bog, right? Is what they call it? I can't remember. Uh, what in the hell is this No Man's Sky bullshit? <laughs> Okay, uh, that's different. Um, interesting looking, um, forest. We gotta go in here. Creekside Sundew Grove. Okay. Oh, cranberries. Or anything in here? Is this toxic or is it just this seriously it looks like something off of No Man's Sky? Just a bunch of cranberries and alien looking plants. Oh I gotta get a picture in here, just give me a sec. This too crazy looking. There. <laughs> That'll do. 
think I saw some other place that looked like this on someone's video. Probably Oxhorn. At least the, whatever the hell that is isn't toxic. Brain fungus. Ah, scorched, diseased cranberries. Oh, there's a uh, watchtower. I like go get that after I check this out. I'm gonna have to move my uh, my house at some point. I'm not quite ready to do that yet because it took me a while to set up the one I've got. Bootleggers shack. Besides, I like the uh, spot I have. Let's check the basement, I guess. Where's the damn key? Jesco, I did it. I killed the old man in his sleep, but I can't find the damn key anywhere. You told me it never left his side, but I swear it ain't up there. I'm starting to think this whole damn plan was a mistake. I'm going back to Bogtown to get a damn drink. Bogtown. That's a brewing station, of course. So I can't get in without a key. High schoolers. I'll show those little token high school shits. They think they can intimidate me? Huh. <laughs> Let's see how they like the changes I made to their batch. Might just explode in their bellies. Crossbow bolts. Oh, oh, there's a crossbow. You know what? I'd like to scrap that. So let's just take it. Ooh, super stim pack. Yeah, sooner or later here, I'm going to have to forego my nice elaborate little house and set up like a uh, simple little mobile shack again. Somewhere down here in the Cranberry Bog. Because after Robco, I'm basically done in the Meyer area for now, at least. junk. There we go. Um, 45, 45. Ooh, I got a scope. I think. For that, I got something. Uh, I'd love to turn that thing off. Watoga High School. Don't take shipments out to Watoga High School anymore. Those Protectron cops tried to scan the crates last time. Good thing they run so slow. Tell those spoiled brats if they want their moonshine, they'll need to come get it themselves. I want to turn this radio off. Oop, didn't actually mean to take that. Old possum. Okay. <clears throat> I think we're done here. Let's go on to this lookout thing. See what kind of markers we can pick up. Something else beyond it, too. I don't want to be going into Watoga yet. It's right there. Yeah, I like this area. As opposed to uh, the mire. It's a little more open and stuff. A lot more open. I'd like to set up my house near this trippy looking forest thing, but I, don't, I think I'll do that on my own time because it's going to take a while. I blueprinted some of like as much as I could of what I have of my current place, but a lot of the details I'll have to manually put back. Let's get 
rid of these Marlurks. What the hell? Hello there. Way over encumbered. Oh shit, not paying attention at all. It's my health. Cloaking trapper left arm. No oh, thanks. Another Gatling gun. Maybe I'll get a mod from it. Oh shit. Whew. I'm paying attention. What? Oh, I killed a legendary enemy. That's why. I forgot you can do that too. To uh, get those things for the Enclave. So hey, we're getting along. Let's go up here. I need your lookout. I may end up having to move my camp. Completely. Is that uh it'd be cool to set it up somewhere out here, just in this area. Oh. This is one I can actually use for a change. It's not gonna use it yet though. Ranger outfit. What do we got? Forward stations, drop site three, a few things. Oh, a lot of things actually. I need to check this place out. There's a bunker over there, fire base. I like this particular area in here. Wow, that was a lot of places. I wonder if maybe I could put a shack out on that little island there. Or like over here. That was a lot of locations. It just picked up 11, damn. I'm in the district office. There's the bog town. There's like no one over here right now. Firebase, Fisher site, mine. Okay. I wonder what the hell that is. Flooded train yard. We are definitely getting down there. Uh, I'm actually, I'm going to check this place out real quick. But then I think I'm going to move, uh, my camp. I've been up in the same place for quite a long time now. I think it's about time we moved. The hell is that? Is there my alert? It was. Oh, I can make one now. I don't need to because I have one, but hell yeah. You gonna turn that thing on every time I walk over here now? You gonna keep physically abusing me every time I tell you no about something? Ugh, you're such a baby. No, I'm a caring and sensitive individual, which is precisely the type of person we need protecting our wildlife. If you had your way, no one would even visit the park. And if you had yours, we'd let in every maniac with a gun to shoot up the place. Not everyone with a gun is a maniac, Ross. And there is nothing wrong with hunting. It is a manly sport. A time-honored tradition. It's murder. It's hunting! <laughs> but why are you a ranger anyway? Because I love nature, and I want to preserve it 
so that people can enjoy it. Same as you. By enjoy, you mean destroy, right? For Christ's sakes, Ross, I'm not a monster. Hey, what is that? A trash can? So that's where my dandy boy apples went. In your goddamn mouth. Yeah, I don't know what you're talking about. Give me that! Get away from me! <laughs> okay. Ranger Simon's terminal. <clears throat> Message from Ranger Ross. I saw you on my side of the office, Simons. This is the third time this week. Yes, I'm keeping a log, and it's going to the head office if you do it again. Ranger Simons reports. Lookout tower is filthy. Trash left on the stairs is a safety hazard. Otherwise, nothing unusual. Beaver population out of control. Need a coal by 30%, but Ranger Ross keeps denying hunting permits because he's too damn soft. Yes, I'm talking to you, Ross. I know you're reading my reports. We have a situation here, so stop coddling those beavers and do your damn job. And clean up the lookout tower. I almost fell down two flights of stairs, tripping over your disgusting leftovers. <laughs> they sound like a great team. Buff out. Fisherman's hat, huh? Ooh, what do we have here? Oh, okay, that was lucky. Oh, I picked up a welding helmet just recently. I'd never seen one before. A ranger outfit. Still hear Marlurks. What's a scrap in here? Beaver. Huh. Ranger Ross's terminal. Read that in a sec. I didn't kill all these. Who the hell killed them? Got a survivor. I need to eat and I need to read my plans. A tomahawk. Nice. Someone else must have been out here before me. Ranger hat. Do I have ranger stuff? I don't know. I should get a, my ranger outfit. And ranger hat going on. Oh, hi. I guess it doesn't matter because I'm always in power armor, but... Shit. Come here. You're a tough motherfucker, holy crap. Jesus. What was I doing? Where'd that go? Where'd that ranger outfit go? I know I just saw it. Damn it. I need that now. Okay, there it is. Cool. Check this out. Workbench finally. Ooh. Marine armor is something I need to make sometime. I haven't messed with actually making armor in quite a long time. 50. Ooh, uh, new magazine. Sweet. Okay, I think we've cleared this place. All right. Okay, I, um, I think I'll stop this one here. Uh, and I'm going to go move my camp and stuff. Set something up around here. It's probably going to take me a little bit. So at the beginning of the next episode, I'll show you what I've done, if it's anything special. And uh, maybe we'll go back up to the Rob Coast spot. Check that out. And yeah, so I'll see you guys next time. Take it easy.